two, one, go. Hey guys, it's Trey and Mom. We have Hazard Cabays and Breaker Excalibur. That's right, so we got a couple of the new Ooh, slingshots. Yeah, Beyblade Burst Turbo Slingshocks. Who do you want to start with? Breaker Excalibur. All right, so it's called Breaker and Hasbro. Yes. See, I wasn't sure. I'm used to calling it Buster, like in Takara Tomy. All right, so let's take a quick look at the package yes. first. We've got Slingshock like Drake's head, Scalius X4, apparently called Breaker Excalibur in the show. And I think so, as of right now, it looks okay. I do notice there's not any metal on sword. But there is metal on the sword right Oh, the so there's layer. on the layer there's metal. Yes. That's good to know. So they did put some metal in this. We'll take a closer look when we get it out, of course. All right, let's flip it over, take a look at the stats. All right, so here are the parts. Like I said, we'll look closer at those when we get it out. This is all the Hasbro names. We'll probably go with the Takara Tomy names. Yes. Yeah, when we talk about it, because it's just easier. All right, and we've got all the stats here for when it's in battle ring mode, because the slingshot drivers have Two modes, of course. The slingshot is, is, is maxed out. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's it like, is. It's like really stable. Well, it looks like, oh, yeah, you're right. It looks like it's balanced. Yeah. It's yeah. Balanced. Yeah. Three and three on there. Okay. So it'll be curious to see how that works. Yes. It does max out an attack when it's in um, battle ring mode. Yes. And that makes sense. It's an attack type. It's got uh -huh. five bursts, yeah, zero defense, seven weight. I guess that comes from the metal in the layer there. Yes and zero stamina but that makes sense it is but you know i think that sword scrapes a lot yeah so it kind of affects stamina to me it slows it down yes. all right so let's get it out let's get it out all right so here's what all comes in the package we got the layer forge disc driver and you know the standard lr, standard LR turbo launcher. ripcord launcher not that strong but it comes with these it's good if you don't have anything else we'll probably use a string launcher today though right, right. All right, so here is the layer, and a lot of these, they color really, really well. I'm noticing right off, this is not as bright as Buster Excalibur is. I mean, I don't think. Just looks a I little... They look the same. Yeah, they look the same. I just think they've done better on some. Maybe it's because you don't do stickers on Hasbro, and like yeah. the blue in the middle of the sword might make it look a little brighter. I don't know. But you did say that this part here, not the whole sword is metal. But like just this part right here, the rest of it's plastic. But the very center tip of the sword, Turbo did give us, or Hasbro did give us some metal in this one. Ooh. So that's nice. I mean, it's nice to see they're bringing that back. And it does feel like it still has the gimmick, the Buster gimmick. Breaker. I know, this is Breaker called Breaker mode. for Hasbro. So it's called Breaker Mode. I hear you. All right, so the sword will go in and out. So to activate that, I'm assuming it's the same. You've got this little tab here. So it's right up here, just like it is in Buster. So let's see if I can do that. I have not done this in so long. There we go. So you push it and it releases it and it's that simple. I mean, you just got to get in there and push it and the sword goes in and out. However, I don't know that this is the best gimmick. What do you think, Drake? Because as it battles, I think it's good. I think sometimes it's good. it'll push it back in. You like it? Yeah. All right. So you can have it in Buster or Breaker mode for Hasbro. I mean, or you can push it back in. So to put it back, you have to push the sword back up and there is a little tab right here you can barely see it but you push that or do you pull it let's see you push it and then it's locked back in so that's how you do the mode change all right and here is the QR for the app as always we will have a link in the description with probably a clearer way to scan that into the app for you guys all right but let's do one more look at these side by side I mean, it's not bad. I don't think it's the best one, though, that they've done as far as making it look the same. I kind of like it. Yeah, you were, you've been excited for this one. Drake was happy we found this release. We actually got this on Amazon Ooh. for retail, which is nice. We don't have to pay any extra for it. All right, and then we have one dash, and that looks exactly the same as Takara Tomy. It's just, for whatever reason, Hasbro's metal is always way shinier, and that's how I always tell the difference. We should check the stars. Yeah, we should. We never check the stars. Scuddy says check the stars. So, let's see. Uh, this is sad. We only got one star. What? <laughs> yeah. We never remember. And when we do, we either get one star or like four. There's never any yeah. in between. All right. So, this is just a one star disc. And the driver. The drivers are probably the most unique thing about the slingshocks yes. because they have two modes. So, this is sword. And let's just see how they look. First of all, I see there's no metal. Like, this is the Takara Tomy. And obviously on Takara Tomy, the swords and the tip are metal, and this there's not. But the design is the same. It's 
It's pretty similar. Right now, I believe it's in Battle Ring. Let's see what happens. It has a little tab here. I think, oh no, you push it. All right, yeah. So that was Battle Ring, and that's where it's just a little bit more exposed. Obviously, Takara Tomy is taller. You see that? Right. Yeah, but it still has that like flower pattern on the bottom. But whenever it is in Battle Ring, it is more exposed. But when you go into Slingshock, it always smooths them out. I guess it goes in the rails, goes a little bit more crazy, that kind of thing. But yeah, that's that. All right, so why don't we look at Hazard? Yeah. And then we're gonna do test spins and we'll battle these two guys against, oh, let's check the slides too. I didn't think about that. Never think about checking the slides. Um, it's actually pretty loose. I'm not sure, we may see some first with that. I don't know. See what you think. I'm not good at filling the slides. I'm better with Takara Tommy's teeth. This is, this is good. You think so? Yeah. Okay. I guess we'll have to see in battle. All right. So now we've got Hazard Curbeus, K4, Beyblade Burst Turbo. And I think this one looks more like the original. Yeah. Than Scalius did. I mean, they're both close. All right. Let's flip it over. Check out the stats. So we got the parts here and it looks like in defense, it maxes out, if that makes sense. Um, weight, it's a six. One burst, one attack, two stamina, so you think it's gonna be really loose? Yes. What I'm excited the most about, they call it TD07-S, but that's Atomic Slingshot. Atomic S, and Atomic's a great driver, so I'm yeah. curious what it's gonna be like. All right, I'm more excited about this one. Drake was more excited about Scalius. So I have a feeling I know who's gonna battle who yeah, in the battle. Scary. Yeah, I'm gonna take Corbeus. You're gonna have Scalius. I have no idea what's gonna happen. All right, so we got it all out here. Once again, LR Launcher comes with the turbos. Let's start with the layer. All right, so the other one had some metal. I don't think this one does. Whereas the chain here on the Takara Tomy Kerbeus is metal. This one is not, but they did a pretty good job of making them look very, very similar. I mean, you can- Does that gimmick? I think it does. Let's check the gimmick. So this That's is- the other one. I know, this is Takara Tomy's. All right, so. It goes in and out, as you can see, for chain counter. Let's see, here we go. It does, yeah, and it feels very similar, yeah. You give it a try. It feels like the, like I guess the tightness it is the does. same. Yeah. yeah. So it does have chain counter, which obviously helps with the fence, deflecting those attacks, right? Yes. Okay, so obviously you can feel the difference in weight though, with this having metal in it and this not. But as far as the look, you got the three dog they heads look there. Similar. Yeah, they look extremely similar. All right, let's flip them over. Check the backs here. Of course, we have the QR code. There again, we'll have that in the link. If you want that for the app, we got slopes versus teeth. So we'll have to see how the slopes work, see how tight this is. All right, and the sevens obviously are the same, but there again, let's remember to check the stars. All right, oh, we got three stars and what? some little weird shape. I don't know, what is that? Look. What is that? It's like three stars. And then it looks like a little dash three. thing. Yeah, I'm not sure what that is, but that's better. Yeah, three stars better than what we get one on the other one. Yeah. All right, so now let's take a look at this Atomic S Slingshot. Okay, so the ball is free moving. Yes. Let's compare it to the other, and the ball moves pretty easily. It might be looser than the Takara Tommy one. This is the Takara Tommy one, obviously. Now, I do notice the ball in the Hasbro one is smaller as well as the outer ring is smaller. You can see that. All right, let's see here. Let's see what makes it. I'm pretty sure this is battle ring. I'm guessing this will come up and make it more even, making the ball less exposed for slingshot. What do you think? Oh yeah, that's what happened. All right, so you turn this and it gets pretty tall. Yeah, that ring comes all the way up, covers the ball completely. Yes, yeah, so none of it's exposed. And this does move some. That's interesting. Ooh. I don't think, does that move on to car Tommy? Oh, it does. I did not realize. And that outer ring comes out some on that too. I don't think I've ever paid enough attention to see that. All right, so we will test this in battle ring as well as nice. slingshot. Yeah, to see what happens nice. before we do this. All right, let's check these slopes. Yep. I'm not good at telling. I'm gonna have to have you do it too. All right, both of these are right spinning, obviously. I didn't say that. Really loose. It, yeah, it is. Okay. Like, I thought Scallius was loose. I'm crazy. This is loose. Yeah, it's just like, um, 
Yeah. Three attacks. All right, so I may have picked the wrong bay because I'm going to be using um, Curveus and it's loose. So we might be seeing some fun bursts though. Yes. All right, let's get set up for test spins. Yes. Okay, ladies first. Yes. Okay, so I'm in battle ring. Let's see what that looks like first. It's going right. There we go. Three, two, one, let it rip. Ooh. Oh, that is really balanced. Okay, nice defense stance. He looks like a defense type. Let's see if slingshot change. Oh, but I mean, burst in my hand the second I picked it up. That's sad. Yeah. Okay, let's mm -hmm. switch this over real quick. So, you just. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Kind of goes up and over like a Z. Yeah. All right. So, this should be considerably different, I think. Kind of crazy, maybe. Maybe. We're gonna see. Okay. Three, two, one. Let it rip. Okay, that is a significant difference. It definitely puts it into the rails, that kind of thing. All right. Okay. Let's see what Scalius looks like. All right. So, are you in slingshot or normal? I'm in breaker mode and the layer. Okay. And breaker mode. Okay. So, battle ring and breaker. Okay. It's pretty balanced. It is. It's way more balanced than I thought it was going to be. All right. Looks like it could get some decent attacks in. It looked kind of slow, though, to me. Probably just that it's a soft launch. Okay. So that was a soft launch. That makes sense. All right. Here's Slingshot. Okay. Oh! I don't know that I like that because with Slingshot, it goes nuts and then it's like, it's almost like the driver might be hitting. Like the swords? Yeah. Did you see that? Like on these raised parts here? All right. So I'm ready to battle. Yeah, All right, so you want to start in Slingshock or? Slingshock. All right, so we're going to start in Fun Mode. We're both in Slingshock, and we're just going to do a few battles with these guys. All right, I'm ready when you are. I am too. You're going to be ready when you are too? <laughs> you didn't call it. What was that? Let's go, go, Come on, go, deflect go. it. Oh, this is close. Really? Yeah. I truly thought I had it. Hey, it didn't burst. All right, let's do one more in Slingshock. Yep. I'm changing it to the other mode. All right, so you're going out of breaker mode, huh? Yep. I don't know if that makes that big of a difference. I know that some people, they're saying that it will go into back into breaker mode. Like, the little lock doesn't yeah. stay locked. I don't yeah. know if that's going to happen to ours or not, but we're fixing to find out. Ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. Two. <laughs> All right. Three, Three two, two, one. Let it rip. Oh, you got stuck in there. This is not. Oh, now I'm stuck. What? What? Mm -hmm. Are you kidding me? You were covered and I didn't. Okay. Battle ring. This is more like standard battle. So Atomic can do its thing. Yeah. And right, Bustard Standard 2 now. Alright, here we go. We'll do a couple battles this way. Three, two, two, one, let's rip. Seriously? Yes. Here I thought I did so good by picking Curveus. Alright, let me grab my layer. Easy, too easy. It was like two cents. Well, we knew that it was loose going into the battles. Yes. And yeah. It was a great burst though, right? Yes. Makes for a fun battle. Alright. Last one. Yeah. Wait, wait, I'm not ready. Set. Set. Three, two, one. Let it rip. Okay, okay, that was better. Tack in. Nothing crazy Break happened the slash. that time. Keep your stamina up. Come on, you're really balanced. Oh, oh yeah, one go more. out with one a more. win. One more. All right, all right, we're one to one. Whoever wins that went, well, in Battle Ring. So whoever wins this one. I want a slingshot. All right, I'm staying in Battle Ring. Oh, for the win? Still. Yep. All right, for the win. Three, two, yeah. one, let it rip. Oh, oh, I don't know. That's making your attacks better. But you're also running out of stamina. What will happen? Come on. I think I got it. I think I got it. No. Oh, oh, yes. What? <laughs> All right, Darn so it. these are fun. Not necessarily. This is pretty good. Yeah, they're not necessarily completely compatible to yeah. Takara Tomy, but they're fun. That one's got some metal on it. Yes. All right, so let us know in the comments. Which is your favorite out of these two? Yes. And I guess that's it for today. Like, subscribe, and hit the bell. That's right, guys. Bye. Bye. Like and subscribe. Enjoy this video.